Hey, what is up guys? John from Magic Tech Review here. Back at it again with a live unboxing of the ZTE Blade Z Max. So I've been trying to do this for a hot minute now. We're going to go ahead and take a nice in-depth look and it's live as well. So you guys can go ahead and comment on uh, what you you know what you want me to do or whatever, what you want guys want to see. I set it back to factory reset. I put the little plastic back on so it's going to be just like if you... Uh, did it yourself so everybody go ahead and please leave a like on the video as always if you enjoy my content please go ahead and comment down below what you want want to see me do uh in the future videos like the uh reviews and what you want me to what you want me to do to the phone or with the phone so let's go ahead and pretty much get right into it what's up barry Eden? what's up though uh kevin rivera so all right so what's all right, so let's go ahead and basically just go ahead and get to this unboxing. Of course, subscribe if you're not a subscriber yet. And also, I want to give a big uh, shout out to Tech Right, my homie from another mother. Uh, he also did this first, basically, on YouTube. I was not allowed to do this, basically, till now. So here we are with this finally un uh, the unboxing. Sorry, I've been teasing you guys for a crazy amount of days now. Uh, I've been wanting to do this, like, forever now. So... Let's basically just go ahead and get into it. Let me go ahead and flip the camera around. Uh, and yes, I'm using my, my nice little tripod here. So hopefully uh, everything goes nice and smooth here. Let me go ahead and straighten it out and get right to that. Ooh. Okay, let's see. All right, so let's go ahead and get, the, get, the, get it looking good here. So here we go with the ZTE Blade Z Max. Nothing but love, homie. I'll hit you up later. Got to go. All right, cool, man. Yeah, Tech Right, bro. Everybody, go ahead and check out Tech Right. Go ahead and check out his channel. Check out his uh, check out his version of this. But we're gonna go ahead and do a, a little uh, unboxing here with you guys live. So thank you all for checking out, checking me out. I see already a lot of likes, a lot of people, like 27 people in here. So it's gonna say 4G LT. We're gonna just read the specs in the back real quick. Just uh, what phone am I using right now? I'm using the ZTE Blade Spark right now, actually. And let me go ahead and adjust this lighting down to here. So we can actually get a little bit more lighting down here. So I got a lot of lighting, guys, today. Hey, Ken Dim says, about time. It looks like the iPhone 7 Plus. So uh, 4G LTE enabled, Android 7.1.1, full HD display with 2.5D glass, 16 megapixel camera on the back, as well as a 2 megapixel as well. It's got a... 8 megapixel front facing camera, 32 gigabytes of ROM. Ken Dim with the $2. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. And you, you can also donate as well. There's a little uh, dollar button down there. So, Ken Dim, thank you for all the donations, man. You're really helping out the family. Uh, really, really helping out the family. Uh, we have a 1.4 octa core processor with a fingerprint sensor. So, I've actually been, hey, tech right, tech right. Everybody, tech right. You got to go check this dude out. All right. So anyway, and you guys, you guys know he's like my freaking partner in crime now. All right. So here we go. So Blade X Max right here. All right. So I'm just going to go ahead and set the Blade X Max down. Those things heavy as shit. So, okay. So that's the Blade X Max right there, guys. So yes, I have been using the Blade X Max and the uh, Blade ZTE Max. So let's go ahead and actually open this up. I'm sure some of you guys have already seen he's here what's up what's up uh so i'm sure you guys have already seen the zte blade z max on other channels and yes uh you know i had this embargo thing going on where i couldn't really do this so but i'm here now to do it with you guys so uh here's the blade zte z max let's go ahead and actually take a look inside the box first to all the all the stuff that's not really that important but i guess important at the same time Yo, TechRite is making it rain, my dudes. So there's the SIM card right there, Metro PCS SIM card, which I have not ins installed yet. Uh, you do get, let me see here. Okay, so this light, all right, cool. That light goes out every so often. So uh, here's the reading materials right there. You do have it in Spanish as well for the Spanish homies out in the crowd. Uh, so it says, Blade, ZT Blade Z Max, Guia Rapida. Why'd they skip Y? They could have named it Blade Y Max. <laughs> the Y Max, right? So I don't even know what this is right here. Attention, atención. Let's see here. Cubierta trasera y la batería no, 
no pueden ser remo removidas. Intentar hacerlo anular la garantía del dispositivo. So basically, that says the back cover and battery cannot be removed. Attempting to remove will void your warranty. So yeah, so basically, guys, don't uh, remove the remove the warranty there. All right, and then we do have a micro USB cord right here. And uh, one thing, guys, right off the bat, that it's it is not mic it is not a uh, fast charging and it's not a fast charging unit. It's not a fast charging unit, so that's not a fast charger. Uh, so in my in my review review, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and notice several things that I noticed about this thing. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and power it up, take a look around, kick the tires around a little bit on this on this device uh, while I ha have all of you here. So uh, let's go ahead and put this back there. So that's basically the box, guys. You don't get you don't. It's not a big big show with the box, but all right. So let's just go ahead and boom, put that back there. Hopefully, I don't disrupt my whole background. Bam. Okay, let's go ahead and bring this camera back a little bit. Okay. And my, it looks like my ZTE Blade X Max is flipping out. Don't get the folio cover. It sucks. Just telling you that, guys, right now. This freaking folio cover makes the phone flip out all the time. Do not, do not get that folio cover. So, if you're gonna think, if you're thinking about getting the Blade X Max, do not get that folio cover. Just not a good, not a good, uh, not a good. At least not for that phone. I don't know. Hey, what's up there? I'm a tech guy. What's up? All right, so we're gonna go ahead and take the front cover off. Take the glass off. All right, it's on YouTube. Hey, okay, so boom, there we go with the back cover. Okay, so uh, let me let me talk about the back cover first. So the back cover is just amazingness uh, to be uh, to be honest. So the back cover is kind of like a tired texture here. So let me go ahead. And yes, guys, you see I've been using it. So yeah, it does collect a few fingerprints. Uh, you know what I'm saying? You might have to wipe it down. You actually have to like get in there tough though with like actually like a little sponge or something like that because it is, uh, it does have like a really, really textured back, almost like a football or a tire. Um, and then you got your speaker down there. So the four holes with the speaker. And let's see here. And then you got your two, two dual dual setup cameras right there let me tell you guys the two dual setup cameras right there are really really nice i've actually been shooting a lot more pictures than i should or than i do i really don't take a lot of pictures uh guys to be honest i'm not like a picture freak or anything like that i like more video like being in front of the camera uh you do have the uh micro usb oh, i'm sorry not micro, micro sd card and sim card slot right there it is a nano sim card you got your type c cable right there you got your microphone and you got your uh headphone jack of course all at the bottom which is i don't know camera is what i meant so uh the bottom stuff right there kind of cool i guess i don't know i don't i'm not a, i'm not a fan of the bottom part right there with the headphone jack at the bottom i like it kind of on the top i don't know i guess i'm kind of weird like that and thank you alex capo for saying it looks nice so far uh we got the we got we got the uh power button and the to volume the volume rocker up and down i like the textured power button of course uh only thing you really have on top right there is the it looks amazing and shiny <laughs> that's funny and then you got the what's the battery size It's 4080 guys it has sd support yes it does have sd support it does have internal and expandable storage support definitely i've been using that so we're gonna go ahead and Go ahead and give it a restart so you guys can see it fully boot on. Yeah, I think so too, Mill Hustles. I think so too. Okay. Price at Metro for court is 1029 So you're going to see here the first the boot up or whatever. And yes, I have been using this device, so it's not like a real first, first boot up or whatever. But uh, I figured I'd take it off and you know restart the whole phone. Just so we can get the out of the box experience. Is it crisp as the ZTZ Max Pro? Yes, it is. It is, in fact. It's uh ten thousand it's uh ten eighty P. Alright. Alrighty, so here we go. Insert sim I'm not gonna insert the sim card right now. It's gonna set up his new phone. So this is what you would do basically. Um, don't okay, we don't wanna do that. Just go. 
Are you on Metro now? I'm still on cricket, guys. Still on cricket. Still on cricket. So we're gonna now we're not gonna take a fingerprint. This is kind of hard to do through a lens. Okay. Skip anyways. All right, and then just we're gonna go next. All right. So that is the front of the screen there, and I will be doing a comparison of the ZTE Blade X Max compared to this uh, ZTE Blade X Max. But let me go ahead and take the ZTE Blade X Max out of the out of the uh, case that it's in real quick, and let's go ahead and take a look. And yeah, I know, I know. Uh, what's up, Jamie? Jamie Slaughter. I never do fingerprint. I don't got time for that. Cameras suck. Internet news and reviews. Are, am I going to activate the phone? Um, probably not. I still have my ZTE Z Max that I'm using. Uh, so I already have that. I already kind of know what Metro is like in my house. So, uh, let me see here. So, uh, this is the ZTE Blade X Max ZTE Blade Z Max, and I'm actually using the uh shit the ZTE Blade Spark to actually review this phone so all so it's funny we have all three blades right now in action uh trying to just to do this review uh so let's go ahead and take a look here at the two phones as you can see guys as you can see the zte blade x max is definitely more thicker so it's definitely a little bit thicker than the zte blade uh blade z max jesus sorry guys if i messed this up x max z max so X Max Z Max, okay. So X Max is on my right, Z Max is on my left. As you can see here, uh, the camera does protrude a little bit on the X Max. X Max is mm, no, they're they're just about the same size. Uh, as far as that goes, let me see how let me see how this looks. This looks right here. So um, actually, very close, very close, uh, very close on that front. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and take a look. Hey, Ken Dim with the with the three dollars again so uh definitely both have textured textured power power buttons right there and then let's take a look at the bottom again of both devices uh will the blade x case fake the z well as you can see here guys it's kind of rounded the x max is kind of rounded and then this one is kind of flat so the blade you like the design of the blade more okay i can't wait for the blade a max that's funny. Uh, so let me see here. So we got the we got the microphones on both things. Uh, so, like I said, it's very 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 close designs. Uh, so it's very close designs, guys. I do like the headphones on the top though. For some reason, I don't know. I don't know what it is, but I mean, just just silly stuff. Uh, I'll go ahead and take a look. Hey, little broomstick, what's up, everybody? And yes, everybody, join the uh, Discord. Oh, let me see. Let me let me see if this will fit. That'll be weird if it fit, huh? That would be kind of weird if it fit. I don't think it's going to fit, though, bro. I don't think it's going to fit. I don't think it's going to fit. No, nah, it's not going to fit. Oh. No, nah, it's not going to fit. It's close, though. It's very, very... I got to say it's very close to fitting, but it's not actually going to fit in there. It's very close, though. It's just a little bit too big. <sighs> okay, so it's not. it won't fit in this folio case. Yeah, folio case just sucks, guys. I don't know why, but it, what it is, I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys real quick on the Blade X Max, the Blade X Max, right? So boom, we're gonna put the Blade X Max in here, right? What it does, it keep what it does is when you're moving it in your pocket like this, it basically turns your phone on and off. So uh, folio case sucks. I wanted to love you. I wanted to love you. I'm not sure if this was maybe for the pro. Was this for the pro there, uh, Mill Hustles? And you just got it for the Blade X Max? Cause I don't know. It, I don't. Ugh. Well, anyway, it's a horrible case. Don't get it. Okay. So enough about that. But the Blade X Max is my boo. I like it. Oh, it's Blade X Max branded. Okay. Huh. Okay. All right. So let's go ahead and turn her on again. Noise reduction, like if you're at a concert recording a live show, will it sound good or was it going to be distorted? Big question there, huh? Uh, man, if you're at a concert watching this in VR, that's what's up. The ZMAX Pro case did the same thing. Ah, okay, okay, I got you, I got you, okay. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and take a look here at just, just the regular things here. 
uh, that we got going on. You know what I'm saying? This does have video calling, guys. This does have video calling. Uh, so, was 30 with port in. Okay, ZT should add quad DAC. Yeah, I think, I think, guys, if you're, uh, what's it called? If you're gonna if you're gonna get this phone, uh, you definitely, or if you're gonna use this at a ACD C high voltage, okay. What you should do, what you should do, guys, if you're gonna record stuff like that, you're gonna want to get like a little mic or lapel mic or something at least, uh, some kind of microphone, especially at a concert. You know what I'm saying? I don't I don't know if you should rely on just this little microphone right here to do any good recording. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know. Uh, I definitely have. Uh, definitely, let me give a shout out to Master of the Moon uh, once again for sending me, he sent me this mic right here real quick, so he sent me this mic right here, so this is the mic that I usually use. Uh, since I'm live on YouTube on my phone though, I can't really do that, but yeah, so you should definitely get something that you can plug in. Uh, okay, so let me get, give me one second guys here, I'm taking care of my son, just going to pour some milk for him real quick, and we'll keep going on with the review so how much is the phone it's 129 guys 129 um what phone are you i'm using the blade spark right now to film with i'm using the blade spark okay so i'm going to show you guys here in just a second and thank you for being patient with me thank you for the 40 people that are watching me right now you guys are all amazing please go ahead and hit that like button and hit the share button hit the share button so people can also join in on the fun um Okay, so here we go. Okay, so I got I got some uh, milk for little John. Okay, so here we go. All right, so okay, so sorry about that, guys. Okay, wow, pretty good audio quality for ninety nine dollar. Yes, yeah, a ninety nine dollar phone, guys. That I'm using. Uh, it's an eight megapixel camera on the back. So maybe I should have used the Blade X Max. Uh, maybe I should have used the Blade X Max to actually record this with, but. I don't know. For the, some reason, the Blade uh, Blade Spark has been pretty reliable to me. I just got the Blade X Max in uh, yesterday, so I kind of wanted to use something. Uh, is the Blade Z Max worth uh, worth upgrading from the Blade X Max? Um, that's I, that that I I I'm gonna wait for my review to tell you guys about that. Uh, I'm gonna point out a few a few things that are not the best about this phone, real quick. So first off, it does not have fast charging. It does not have fast charging. Okay, uh, so well, that's one thing that I kind of miss. Now it is a big, it is a big phone. It is. It, I'm, I'm sorry, not a big phone. It is a big battery. So it's a 4,080 milliamp battery. So it does last pretty long. I do have to say that. So the fast charging, I guess, is not that big of a deal. And your USB Type C charging usually does charge pretty fast anyway. But there is no. Uh, there is no fast charging on it. Okay, so dual camera, manual mode. Okay, and start. All right, so we started that up. Okay, set. All right, so. Okay, so one one big key thing that I'm gonna point out about this phone, and I'm probably gonna mention this in another video as well. So as you can see, guys, I'm actually using a little tripod. I'm using my cheapo tripod. I do have a better tripod as well, but I'm just using this one. Uh, but. My, my main concern here, my main concern here is that the front camera is only 720p. That's the only issue that I have. So you see here how you go, you go to video quality. So when you go to video quality, you can only do 720p and MMS video. So, so here you go. See guys, that's my own, that's my only thing with this Blade Z Max. That like as far as any 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 kind of gripes or concerns, that's my only thing. That's like kind of whatever, you know what I'm saying? But uh, okay, so that's the only thing. Other than that, guys, it takes really good uh, takes really good uh, pictures. You know what I'm saying? It takes really good video. What's up, guys? John from Magic Tech Review. Blah 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 blah. Yeah yeah yeah. Like like subscribe. Boom boom boom. Okay, and then we're gonna go ahead and play that video back. And let's see what it sounds like. Let's see here. Uh, let's see, video player. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, allow, whatever. Okay. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. 
All right. Hey, Norma Gonzalez, what's up? Everybody say, everybody drop a one in the chat who's here real quick. I want to tell it. I want to say hi to everybody that was here. Uh, definitely. You got your, you got your smile shot. I'm going to try to, I'm going to try to, I'm going to try to keep up. I don't think I'll be able to keep up, but I'm going to try to say hi to everybody. Little Boomstick. What's up? Uh, oh my God. Alex Capo, Jose Royal. Oh my God. Han Brandy, uh, Robert, uh, Hugh Pinkon, Fat Max. What's up? Okay, so I don't think I was able to keep up, but whatever. BBB is here. Balthar, I, yeah, you got to change that name, bro. Chris Palmer is here. All right, so uh, let's see here. So we're going to go with the selfie mode real quick. Actually, let's go ahead and take a look at the filters too as well. So we do have a lot of filters on here as well. Whoa. Uh, Chris Palmer, Illinois band, Shea Kennedy. So thank you, guys. Thank you, all you peeps that are here uh with me for this live unboxing then we're gonna do a review hey this won't have a metal build no it does not how about the blade spark uh no neither one has a metal build they just have the they just have the faux aluminum around it um hello Lindsay. hey honey how are you doing first time viewing love your reviews thank you david fox so uh yeah so this is the fish eye you know we got all these different uh all these different filters that you can choose from guys let me see here. So we got all these different things. Dad. I can't wait to get this phone. I don't know who said that. Uh, but yeah, so and then this is the beauty. This is so that's the that's the selfie part. Does it include my dad? No, sorry. So let's see here. Let's get. And then it does have this the the thing where it, it takes selfies, caption smile, a all right, so we're going to go ahead and take a look at that. So, as you can see, pretty good there. Pretty good. Pretty good. And that's that. Okay. How big is the screen? It's a six inch screen. Six inch screen. All right, and that's the beauty part right there. I don't know how beautiful I'm going to look, but it's, I guess it's doing. Hey, oh my god, let me take the smile capture. So smile capture definitely works. Let me uh turn up let me crank up the uh let me crank up the brightness on this bad boy. So sorry if you guys cannot see now. Uh but yeah, so let's go ahead and take a nice little thing and let's go ahead and soften that up. So all right. So let's see let's see how that looks. So there you go, guys. So it is, yeah, it is a 720p camera in the front, which is kind of meh to me, but it's, I don't know. I don't know. Um, so I, I can say the back camera is amazing, guys. And I'm going to have a link to this in the description below, so you can go ahead and pick it up as well. Uh, if you want to just click on my link and, you know, whatever. Uh, they gave me a little link, basically, just to show who's actually watching the video and who's, you know, supporting or whatever. So... If you do guys are interested in the phone or whatever, just click on quick click on my link that I leave down below, just to show ZTE that I actually brought you here and that you guys are actually watching because of me. You know what I'm saying? And maybe leave in the comments below when the video goes up, like, hey, you know, I love the phone. Thank you, ZTE. Whatever, whatever the case may be. Okay. So just just help me out basically so I can bring more reviews and content to the channel. All right. So now we're looking at the back camera, guys. Now we're looking at the back camera. So now we got. Now we got some 1080p uh, going on right here. So we're going to bring, uh, I don't know, we'll just bring this into focus right here real quick. So uh, they're watching for me and the hustle's not you. Okay, thanks, man. Sorry about that. I didn't know that. So let's go ahead and go through some of the settings real quick. Mine's a Z Team Z Max Pro. What's up, Blades there? 8922. All right. So let's see here what we got going on. So we have a flash, obviously. You got your flash. You can go on and off. Uh, let's see here. We got your HDR. So I got, you got your HDR going on here. You got your video right there. Oh, okay. That's bright as crap. So let's go ahead and turn that. Let's go ahead and turn that off real quick. Okay. So let's take a video real quick. Hey, what is up everybody? John from Magic Tech Review doing this little test video. Oh my God, it's so cool. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And yeah, so anyways, boom, done. All right, so we're going to go ahead and take a look. Hey, what's up, John Miller? 
There you go. All right, so there you are with that. That's the no notifications. Damn, everybody, go ahead and share this out. Share this out. Definitely want people to be watching this, watching this, and especially on the replay. Oh, what's up there, Tech Raw? What's up? What's up? Hold on, actually, let me let me fix that. No, let me fix that no notification part real quick. Hold on, let me. I'm gonna share this out to everybody. So, actually, let me go ahead and let me go ahead and boom. Okay. So there we go. Share this out. Crowdfire. Crowdfire is definitely awesome. If you're a YouTuber and you want to share this to everybody, this is going to put it on Twitter. Boom. Boom. All right. So there you go. All right, boom. So that did that. Okay. Okay, now let's turn this one off. Okay, so. All right, so cool. Okay, so. What were we doing here? Okay, so we're going to take a look at some other stuff here. Oh, let me turn the brightness down because the brightness is like really bright now. Okay. So. How small does the fonts go in the icons? How small can you make them? Okay, so. I got to go see tomorrow. Okay, they're a little broomstick. All right, so uh, let's see here. Display. Uh, let's see font size. Let's see font size. Big. So we got big, largest, smallest. So that's the smallest it goes. That's the smallest it goes. And that is the biggest it goes right there. So. Yes, it's 7.1.1. Uh, let me see here. Display size. So you have your usual you have your usual stuff here from ZTE. So you have your usual your usual stuff with ZTE cast. You can cast you navigation key light. So there we go with that. Uh, let's see. Let's check out sounds here. All right, and then let's go ahead and take a look at the Dolby Dolby Audio, and let's go ahead and let's go ahead and pump this up. Does Fox Five work with the phone? Hmm. Hmm. Huh. I don't know about that yet. So let's go ahead and crank this thing. Let's go ahead and crank this all the way up. I'll definitely be doing a Fox Five thing for real, for real. So. Okay. Sorry guys, I'm like doing this through a, uh, I'm doing this through a phone, through a phone. So, all right, so let's go ahead and crank that up, crank that up. Okay, sorry, sorry I'm about to, I'm trying to keep this as steady as I can. I'm doing this live for you guys, so it's a little different. So let's see. Next time, tell your girlfriend to earning money in this. Oh, uh, zombie droid. What's up, man? That's my wife, bro. So chill out with all that. All right. She's just, you know, when it comes to little, when it comes to little John, you know, she wants me to take care of him, obviously. So uh, I gotta do, I gotta do what I do can do for my, for my, uh, for my son and stuff like that or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So he's first priority. Uh, but anyways, all right. So. Uh, let's see here, but all right, so let's go ahead and uh, get on YouTube real quick. So let's go ahead and all right, so let, let me put in my password real quick. Don't need anybody knowing my password to my Wi Fi, just but all right, so we're gonna connect, all right, connected. 
equalizer settings video on that phone to get the highest volume. Thanks. Nope, no problem. I will. All right. Go to focus preset and then crank that up the mid. What's up, John? How that feels compared to ZTZ Max Pro? Um, let me give you an in hand feel. Let me give you an in hand feel, uh, real quick, guys. In hand feel. I kind of like the curve of the ZTZ Max Pro and the X Max and the Grand X Max 2, to be honest. Uh, you know what I'm saying? The flat design is good as well, but I don't know. I kind of like the curve, but, uh, you know, some people, they don't dig the curve because of the whole, you know, thing where it, I guess it like, it, it rocks back and forth on the thing. Like if you're, you know, if you're ty 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 uh, typing or doing something, it's going to rock back and forth. So this one absolutely has no rock. Okay, that's what's up, Zombie Droid. It's fine. It's fine, bro. It's fine. You're 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 cool. Uh, your comment just got deleted because you know you, you were talking about the wifey like that, but it's all right. I understand. Everybody's um. With bit better camera, just saying. Uh, fuzzy mustachio. Yeah, I'm doing it live. That's that's the only thing. That's why it kind of looks like this. I'm sorry, guys, that the live streaming. Uh, doesn't come out yeah so it doesn't come out like that if if i did it like you know whatever then it wouldn't be live and i wanted to do this live with you guys so you guys can get this full experience but yeah uh yeah so all right so so in hand feel guys uh the zte blade x max definitely feels wider a bit heavier uh you know what i'm saying more bulkier uh, I actually like the bulkiness, and I actually like all this stuff on the Blade, like the Blade X Max. I love the Blade X Max, okay. And the I, have, I love the Blade X Max. I love the. Oh no, problem there, Fuzzy Mustachio. You are good, my friends. Hold on, let me plug in. Let me plug in my other. Let me plug in my phone. Let me see. And definitely, hold on. Okay, cool. All right. Oh, I think that's what it was actually. My phone is. My phone was dying, so I was actually getting a little bit. Okay, so, okay, so, um, I actually really, really, really like the heaviness and the weight of the ZT Grand X Max, or I'm sorry, Grand X Max, ZT Blade X Max. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I actually like the weight and the feel of both these phones. Um, this is lighter. It has that rubberized feel to it. So yeah, it definitely has a good, good feel to it as well. I'm more used to this one, but my battery's at 21 percent. But yeah, so I would, you know what I'm saying? I'll probably get used to this one as well. You know what I'm saying? I just, I don't know why. I just love like heavier phones. But, uh, you know what I'm saying? Either one is good. Fat Max, what's up? So, okay, so uh, what is my main fault? My main fault is the ZTE Z Max, the original actually. Uh, it's the original Z Max with 4.4 KitKat. Uh, that's the one I use to um, facilitate all this uh, stuff, like to, to make my Wi-Fi work, as used by, as a Wi-Fi hotspot, it's unlocked from Metro PCS, and I'm using Cricut in it. Hey, yeah, ZTZ Max Club present definitely. Uh, so, and these two are my these two are my daily drivers as well. I know people don't like the word daily driver sometimes, and it makes people cringe. Uh, but yeah, I guess everybody knows about daily driver. But uh, yeah, so these two are my these two right now are my daily drivers and uh the z max so that's the three phones that i'm going to be using now uh, so basically i have the uh and i also have the Alcatel idol 4 uh the blade spark which is recording this whole thing i'm not going to be using the blade spark uh that much it's going to kind of go go in the drawer uh and my uh and the samsung galaxy s3 uh which mill hustles was very very uh thankfully you sent me bro um uh, Anthony, no, I do not. Hey, man, bet you know who I am. LOL. Anthony, no, I don't think I remember you there, bro. Who are you? Is the camera better than the Z? Yeah, the camera definitely is better. I uh, definitely went. I definitely just went through that. But uh, okay, so I'm getting all this Metro stuff now. Uh, so let me show you guys how you can just remove all the Metro stuff. Uh, basically, just you know, you just go through and just take it all away. So um, you know what I'm saying? You just disable so you just disable everything how's the battery life battery life is great i didn't like the battery life on the ztz max pro 
Uh, for some reason, it felt like it was draining a lot faster. Uh, so yeah, so this is better. Do a benchmark test. All right, I'll do a benchmark benchmark test. Oh, damn, that means I gotta sign in and I'll be. So maybe I maybe I shouldn't have reset everything. So maybe I shouldn't have reset everything. Will that phone with Metro P? Yeah, of course it'll work with Metro PCS. This is a Metro PCS phone. Uh, let's see here. Boom. Let's go ahead and disable that. Sorry, my camera's like freaking out right now. My guess is that the phone will get 50000 on N22. Uh, I don't do the N22 one. I usually do the. Uh, let me see. Which one can I can I do any can I do any one that I don't have to actually download the stuff or do I have to download it? Uh, okay, you can't get rid. Of, that's the only thing you can't get rid of, basically. Uh, so you can't get rid of my Metro, but you can get rid of Metro. This one right here. So sorry for the camera freaking out again. Ah. Okay. So. Uh, okay. So let me sign. That's gonna take. It's gonna take a hot minute. It's gonna kill. It's gonna kill my stream if I do all that, guys. So. I don't think I'm going to do that. Richard, you think it's worth the 135? Uh, okay, so let's go ahead and go in here as well. Let me show you guys this. I'm going to show you guys in a different video, of course. But you can go all the way down, right? And you can go to About Phone. And you can go to Build Number. And you start tapping it, right? Look, you are now four steps away. You are now three steps away uh, for being a developer. You're now two steps away. You're now one step away. You are now a developer. So you can go in. I do this on damn near every phone right here. Go to develop options. And then you go. I like to go down all the way to the bottom. And scroll a little bit up. Uh, let's see here. Where is that thing at? Smallest width. Okay. And I like to disable these three things right here. Window animation scale. So let's go ahead and real quick. And yeah, no, I, sh I should have cut my nails right before this. Damn it. Nails are a little long. They're not that long. They're not that disgustingly long but they're a little long today but anyways yeah my nails and my hair grow long obviously guys because i don't know but anyways so here here it looks like with the animation off uh now it's like even super duper faster than it usually is uh but yeah okay so uh the unlock thing of course you can't unlock it right out the gate but that's your unlock thing so use this thing for three months and you'll be able to look it look it up i put mine to 0.05 0.5 Okay, Allo Lindsay. Uh, permanent unlock. And yeah, you're not going to be able to... Because it still shows animation. But they are snappy. Permanent unlock. Unlock field. This mobile device not eligible for unlock yet. For device unlock eligible details, please go to... So that's what you do, guys. Once you got, th once you got three months, you go boom right there and you unlock the phone. And then now you have an unlock phone on Metro PCS. It uh, looks like it comes with a Duo app. That's pretty dope as well. I like that. comes with an FM radio. A lot of phones don't come with FM radios nowadays, which is kind of awesome. Uh, okay, so uh, Lookout. Definitely don't need no Lookout. So definitely don't need no Lookout. Boom. So what don't you like that? What's with the issue with it? And it's definitely... By I'm contemplating on the, okay. Uh, the only thing the only thing I don't like it doesn't have fast charge. The little finger guys, huh? What? I don't understand that, Richard. What you're talking about? Um. So yeah. So the things I don't like about the phone so far, or whatever. The only the only two real main issues, uh, no fast charging and 720p voice. John voice call me. Hello. No, Richard's having game. Uh. So. Only only two things so far that's like meh. No uh wrong chat, sorry, no problem there, guy. Uh it's got 720p camera on the front and no quick charging. So the quick there's no quick charging. Unless I'm totally wrong, unless I'm totally wrong. Actually, let me get let me get the charger out. Let me get the charger out of here and let me plug it in right right quick. Uh and then let me tell you, let me show you, or let me let me just make totally sure because I have a quick charger. And it was not working on it. So let me see. Let me see. Then maybe maybe I'm totally wrong. Uh, all right. So let me see here. So we're gonna go ahead. I'm pulling out the box right now. And pulling out the box. And let's see here what what she's what she does. So maybe I'm totally wrong. Let's try it out. I don't want I don't want to be wrong, right? I don't want to be wrong and 
mess everything up. Okay. Okay. So that's what it, okay. So it supposedly has it, right? So let's go ahead and plug this in real quick. So I will plug it in, plug it in, plug it in. Uh, all right. So let's see here. Okay. Okay. All right. So let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. So. All right. So we'll show it. Okay. So let's see. Let's see. Maybe. Maybe. Okay. Maybe it's because. Okay. All right. So let's see here. All right. So let's go. Charging. It says charging. It does not say fast charging. All right. And you said it says it when it's off, right? So let's power it off. Power it off. Shutting down. So, and guys, just because it doesn't have, uh, you know, the quick charging thing, I, whatever. It's, you know, not that big of a deal. Power shutting off. Okay, there we go. Go shut yourself off. Okay. Okay, so let's see here. All right. All right, so, and that is the plug that actually came with it. So, ah, well, I guess I was wrong then. So does it, is it fast charge? Huh, that's crazy. Okay, so there you go. The only part that I don't like about this phone then is 720p. Huh, I was wrong. Look at that. Jesus. Okay. I'm wrong. Hmm. Thank you guys for letting me know about that. I'll have to put a little correction in on the front end or whatever. I'm sure people are going to be getting me. Hey. <laughs> Told you, LOL. Okay. Okay. Huh. Because my Grand X Max 2, my, my ZT Grand X Max 2 did it right on the front screen. Right when you just, when you pressed the, you had one job. <laughs> LOL. Thought it was a video. All right, so see, because my ZT Grand X Max Two, it shows the fast charging right here. It shows the it shows the fast charging right here. Hmm, and it just says charging. Why won't it say fast charging here? Will it not fast charge when it's on or something? Hmm. Okay. So it does have fast charging. Okay, Fuzzy Mustachio, no problem. Let me take this charger out before I break it or before I mess with it. Damn, that thing is like... ZT wants to keep it a secret. I don't know why they... Why do they want to keep it a secret? They want to like... I don't know. But anyway, I'm still working night butt out. Okay, that's what's up. All right, so let's go ahead and move on to... Uh, let's go ahead and go on to, to YouTube. YouTube. So... Hmm. All right. Let's go ahead and go to YouTube. Okay, search YouTube. New charging sound I meant. Oh yeah, the new charging sound. They don't they they don't want to make the competition look too bad, LOL. I mean all ZTE phones, I really like pretty much all ZTE phones as you can see. And it will affect charging. Oh, so okay, so it's only fast charging when you power it off, or what? I don't, I don't. That's that's my question or concern or question. Yeah, question I should say. All right, so let's get a uh, let's see, let's get a 1080p video up. Um, 1080p or uh, actually, let's just go with uh, let's just go with some let's go with some F zero first. F zero OST. Let's go with some F zero. What was my first ZTE phone? Uh, the ZTE Warp from Boost Mobile. Use it, your amp test. Oh yeah, the amp test. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't see. I don't know why I, I deleted everything off of here so you guys can get a first first feel for it. So. So there you go. 
I wouldn't say it's, it's the loudest phone in the world, but my first ZTE phone was a ZTE Avid Plus. Okay, what was everybody's first ZTE phone, or what kind of phones you got right now? Uh, those that are watching me, so watching me play with this uh, phone. What is the highest wa resolution to watch on YouTube? Uh, okay, give me somebody. Give me. Give me somebody. Give me a video. I don't want to get copyright, man. That's the only thing I'm worried about. Uh, somebody give me something that's non-copyright that I can search for, like, highest quality. Uh, let me see here. Fade. Let me see. Fade. Fade Alan Walker. Jesus. Fade Alan Walker. Alan Walker. Fade all, really, really, fade all around, really. Oh my God, this is hard to do through a fade. Alan, Alan Walker. Okay, fade. Alan Walker. Here we go. Let me see if this is even what this is wrong. Keeping up with friends is faster. Yeah, guys, sorry. My connection is kind of weak, so, right now. All right, so we're going to go right here. But, yeah, 720p right there. But the highest you should be able to go is 1080p. So I'm trying to see something that's 1080p. Uh, let's see here. I just don't want to get copyrighted, man, for something stupid here. 720p. Hmm. Fade is just the lyrics. Fade is an instrumental. Uh, okay, so I'm trying to see. Somebody give me a 1080p video that I can watch real quick. Uh, well, I guess I'll just type in 1080p video, right? 1080p. 60fps. Spider-Man Homecoming. Transformers. Optimus Prime. Oh, Jesus. Okay, whatever. We'll just go with this one. I will just stop it before it goes. There we go. Here we go. Look. 1080, 1080p, 6, 1080p, 60 frames per second. So there you go. There you have it, guys. 1080p, 60 frames per second. So those are all basically all the qualities you can watch in right there. So that's that. So yeah. But definitely don't want to get copyright for any of this stuff. Yeah, don't don't need something stupid like that happening on my channel. Uh, so 1080p, 60 frames per second. Okay. All right. If anything, you are using the content under fair. Oh, I know, I know, man. But it's as soon as they see it or hear it, they're gonna they're gonna flag my video, and then I'd have to freaking put a counterclaim in and all that stuff, man. It's just not worth the headache. Uh, so let's see what else it comes with out of the box. Calculator, calendar, camera, Chrome. Oh, let me show you the let me show you guys the effects. Jesus, I don't know what the heck I'm doing. What am I doing with my with my life? Okay, so we got the we got the dual camera. So yeah, and then I love this uh, I love this monochrome thing. So the monochrome thing you can do you can do the red. So that'll literally just take out the just have the red coming out. Ah, uh, shit. Let me see. I'm trying to. Trying to see what I can use here. So let's say, okay, let's say, uh, okay, so let's say I have a bunch of stuff here. Okay, so I'm gonna have to point this camera down a little bit. Okay, see, see how it just, see how it just takes out the red, the red. See that, see how that cable is just a red cable. See. See how it does all that? See? So it kind of just does that. I'm going to have to move the camera on uh, tripod a little bit around. But so see how it does that? It's pretty cool how it does that. How it just takes out the on. Okay. So as you guys can see, you can see that it's a full color range right there of different colors. But when I put it right here, you see? All you can see, all you can see is the red in there. And then I can take it out and I can put it. Hold on, let me do the balance of it. All right, so now you can pick the different color. 
and you can pick the green out. And you see now you can only see the green. You can only see the green in there. So that's pretty dope as well. And then you can do the blue. And you see how you can just see the blue in there? It's freaking cool, man. I really... You're a, you're a phone hoarder? Now these are just pamphlets, guys. <laughs> you said I'm a phone hoarder. <laughs> oh, man. All right, let's, so let's do one Boken shot real quick. And we're coming up on 50 minutes, guys. So thank you all for those of you that stuck around for as long as you did. You guys are awesome and amazing. So we're going to take a dual. We're going to do a dual shot with the uh, Boken effect. So, actually, you know what I'll do? I'll take a I'll take a picture of all of you guys here. Okay, so I'll take a picture of the scene that I'm doing right now, and I'll show you guys. So let me uh, let me take a picture here. Take a couple pictures, boom, and then we'll see what the bokeh looks like. Let me see here. What is it? Okay, right there. Cool. Okay. All right. I'm coming right back. Okay, so here, let me show you. Okay, so let me show you what the Boken pretty much does. So you see how. See how everything else is kind of blurred out except the, uh, except the camera there. So, kind of dope how it does that. So let's uh, see if I can, re okay, so. So let's refocus it real quick. Okay, so we refocused it. Okay, so we checked it off. Okay, so that's the refocus. So you see how it does that? You see how everything else is so I really like that. I really like the Boken effect on there. Hey, Lindsay Edwards. What's up, honey? So. Okay, so that's the double cameras. Oh, yeah, but you don't have to go through apps at all like that. See how this one came out? So. Oh, you see this one I did earlier, the monster? You see how the monster is really... Yeah, of course you're going to see a review tomorrow. This is just an unboxing or whatever, basically, late stream. Yeah, so this is basically just like a little little unboxing and showcase type type of thing. So yeah, you're going to get a full you're going to get a full reviews. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this back and we will talk for a minute. And everybody join on Discord cuz I'll be on Discord and all that other goodness stuff. So I'm going to turn the camera around again. And we're gonna just talk. We're just gonna talk like normal people. And I'm gonna turn my brightness up. Hey, hey, hey. All right. So, okay. So hopefully you guys enjoyed uh, enjoyed that. You know what I'm saying? This was shot on the Blade Spark ZTE Blade Spark. Um, and yeah. So I did. I have used the phone for about a week now. Mm, mm -mm. So I had to use the phone for about a week now and. It's just a very awesome phone. So if you're wondering about, you know, actually upgrading to this phone or not, definitely it's a great idea to do it, especially if you if you're a ZTE fan. And Allo Lindsay, thank you for thank you for everybody uh, who's been here since the beginning of the video, who actually stayed the whole the whole time or whatever in the video. Let me know. Uh, and getting the phone on Thursday. Okay. So yeah. So I think. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I've been using, and I'm getting the phone on Thursday. Okay, so what camera do you have? I'm actually using the ZTE Spark right now. I'm using the ZTE Spark. So you guys can actually, that's what you can see. That's what I see right there, guys, when I'm filming. So that's the ZTE Spark right there on my little tripod that I'm using. Boom. So yeah, so that's what that's what I actually see when you guys, when you guys drop a comment right there. So me, me, I did. Okay, Alan, Alan, Alan Lindsay, uh, Illinois man, Shay Kennedy, Batman. <laughs> yeah. So, and Little John did really excellent right now because he had, he, he hasn't actually said anything. 
Uh, so he really he really helped us out tonight as well. He was being a good boy. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So you guys know uh, the channels for Little John, Mute Autistic and all that stuff. Uh, and I love this little light that I'm using. I'm actually using two lights right now. Uh, let me go ahead and turn that around and show you guys real quick. Yeah, I'm a little tired. I'm a little tired. So let me show you guys real quick. So I'm using that light right there, the LED lollipop light. And I'm using a uh, another light right there that's not as bright. So yeah. And I got my regular kitchen light as well. So yeah, I'm using two light, three light sources um, to light the scene up. So hopefully it's nice and bright for you and it's uh, coming out really clear. Um, but yeah, I really, I really do like the, I really do like the lighting or whatever, and I think it makes it look a lot better. So, and as you can see there, right there, boom, we got some, we got some stuff going on there. Uh, let's see here. Turn the kitchen light off. Turn the kitchen light off. I'm gonna try that. Let me try. It. All right, let's see. Turn the kitchen. He said, turn the kitchen light off. All right. How does that look? Power bills though. Yeah. Uh, how do you become a moderator or whatever it's called? Uh, just stick around for a hot minute. Boot loop failure. LG is, uh, uh, stick around for a minute and you know what I'm saying? Uh, we just, we get, we get moderators, but I don't, I don't tend to give them out a lot just because, uh, there's a lot of things you can do. It's a lot, it's a lot of, uh, hella crisp. Okay. That's what's up. So yeah, you guys like this? Uh, hey, Ra uh, Raymond Patrick. So you got you guys like man, I like I like the black I like the damn uh, black uh, hair right there. I like how my hair got freaking black. Discord too. Oh yeah, yeah. So you guys like it like this better, where where it's just the kitchen the kitchen light is off and it's just the two the two lights helping helping uh, do this. So I don't know. You guys can tell me. I guess what looks good. Explosive. Uh, you have to be. You have to be a liberal to be a. <laughs> oh my God, you guys are funny. Yes. All right. Cool. Yeah. I don't know. What's Discord? Oh, Discord is where we all we all talk. Basically, we could talk after the stream is done, after the stream is over, or whatever. Uh, you can voice chat on there. I'm on there sometimes. I'm not on there all the time, but yeah, we can basically interact over there. Yeah, the two makes it look like it's daylight outside. Okay, that's what's up. Yeah. So. Uh, yeah, so without the LED lights, it would probably be really dark. So let me try that out. I'm gonna I'm gonna test you guys out as guinea pigs. So yeah, that's whoa, that's whoa, that's dark. That's really nah, that's not good enough. That's not good enough. So that's one LED light. That's the low L, the low setting. That's the medium setting right there. It's the medium setting. So medium setting right there. And that's the brighter setting right there. So there you go. There you have it. So lurk mode. <laughs> All right. I hear a bird. Oh yeah, that's little John's little uh, thing. It's a nature thing we have for him. Uh, LG law suit they have going on. LG oh the LG lawsuit. Yeah, uh, I've I've seen the I've seen the boot loop thing happen to plenty of people. Uh, to be honest, and you know what I'm saying. It's it was hard to recommend LG sometime, you know, but it didn't happen. It didn't happen on every phone, so I don't know what they're gonna what they're gonna do or whatever. But yeah, it's pretty bad when it does happen to you, especially if you don't have anything else, anything else to use or whatever. Uh, but yeah, the wife just texted me too. Uh, the wife just texted me, and I don't want her calling me right in the middle of the stream. So let me answer her real quick before she starts calling. She's gonna kill my stream. Uh, shit. Shoot. Uh, what do you think about the LG law? Okay. Cannot connect. Oh, damn it. Uh, but anyways, all right. So, uh, so I think we went on for about an hour. Thank you, uh, for everybody that uh, liked the video. Thank you, everybody, for the donations. Uh, just thank you everybody in general for this after no said my sister lost okay it happened to me with this okay if you can get custom your own phone with specs uh that's a lot to that's a lot to go go through right now guys but yeah so I wanted to make this thing exactly an hour long so if you want to you know thank you for everybody on the replay crew if you actually got all the way to the end 
put uh, put in the comments below. Uh, hashtag ZTE MTR for life. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Put that. Have a good night, brother. Yeah, so put that. If you're in the replay crew and you saw this with all the way to the end, uh, leave that in the comments when. So hashtag ZTE. ZTE for life or MTR. Yeah, yeah. ZTE, uh, hashtag MTR ZTE, something like that. Uh, you're going to be giving one away for free. Uh, no, Jamie, no. I don't I don't make enough money to be doing that. Uh, but yeah, so I, that's, well, I'm saying when the replay comes and people actually commenting on the comments down below, that's how we'll know, uh, that's how I know that somebody actually watched it all the way through in the replay because I don't know, an hour to watch me on a replay is a lot. So I don't think anybody's going to get that far. But hopefully everybody enjoyed this little unboxing and experience and blah, blah, blah. You guys are amazing. And, yeah, peace out, guys. Thanks for watching. And, uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys later. And I'll have some more reviews tomorrow, of course, uh, coming up. Bye. Join us, on the, join us on the Discord. Join us on the Discord, everybody. Join us on the Discord. I'll go on the Discord and chat with y'all for a little bit. All right. That's too much eye strain. Oh, well, they might skip. Five seconds. They might skip five seconds. All right. Peace out. Uh, what do you mean you don't make enough money? Jamie Slaughter. You said I don't make enough money. I don't make. If you only knew. If you only knew how much money the YouTuber actually makes. There's not even that. <laughs> it's so. Not enough money uh, for what. For what. How much actual work and stuff we put in every day. And how much. Uh. How much we actually uh, think about it, you know what I'm saying? When you're doing YouTube, especially when you're around that five, six, seven thousand mark, you're thinking about it every day. Uh, I figured ZT would give you a free phone giveaway. No, they did. They gave this phone to me, but I'm keeping it basically. You know what I'm saying? Life is hard, man. It's hard out here. Yeah, it's hard out here for. It's hard. It's hard out here for for uh, a phone sales rep. Nah, we. Nah, I get more than five dollars, but. You know what I'm saying? And it, it ain't have an app. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Discord does have an app. So, all right. Peace out, guys. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.